Hi all, good morning. Uh, welcome to Azure Talks. So uh, many of uh, you guys are uh, many of you are actually asking uh, that how you can come to Dynamics 365 as a finance uh, consultant and uh, then uh, uh, I guide you. And then later on, you basically come to me that uh, how to access the environments. So to access the environments, the best way is to have free. Do not pay anybody from any link. The best way is to go to uh, go and search MB330. Once you see MB330, what you can do is you can uh, quickly uh, go to the first link, which talks about the docs.microsoft.com. Always go with this link. Just click on this. So the challenge is that how we can actually uh, get a free environment link to practice your labs. So best way is to go to the exam, uh, the certification, this URL, the URL I will be putting in, into the uh, chat window, uh, into the description. So I'm just making a note of it. And then go down and then you will see schedule examination. So we are not here to schedule the examination, but to access the lab go to this uh, and then there is an option wherein how to prepare the examination how to prepare for the examination though you are not preparing but it is showing you how to prepare the examination i am telling you how you can actually access the finance and operation application url for free so uh, there is online and instructor lead okay so be on the online section and then if you see there will be first configure and manage products in the inventory supply chain management click on this and once you go down, you will see there is uh, a learning path. So yes, uh, the recommended learning path is this. And in case you want to, uh, in case you want to directly go to the lab, I will say click on this lab. So if you see there is lab explore 15 minutes. So click on this 15 minutes is a 15 minutes of activity, but you can avail it for uh, a good time. Okay. So there is uh, you need to um, launch the uh, virtual machine launch it and you will see a quick portal uh, for giving you the access for the lab client dot lab on demand this will open and it will take around one minute to build your environment once it is built then you should be able to access the finance and operation application and then you can practice your lab I will just show you give me a minute so we'll wait for until it is uh, finished So the best way is to go to this and then over here uh, go to the free online material and then click on the lab. Okay, so this lab is uh, now visible. Now how you can how you can actually enter the administrator. So go to resources there will be administrator password as pass at the rate word one so just uh, you don't need to type it over here the best way is to click on the t t means type so you will be able to type that into the prompt and say next so once you submit okay there will be uh, do not close anything just wait and uh, once this is done you should be able to open the prompt go to the uh, internet explorer the url which is already mentioned over, over here is this url which is automatically coming in onto the default browser which is edge let it open and uh, once it is uh, it shows the login prompt just use the user id and the password user id is your uh, user one at the rate user one some numeric number at the rate uh, triple crown lab solutions.com so we have to just press on the t button and then it will be typed so it may take time because uh, when it uh, when virtual machines goes uh, online uh, the the ias actually takes the warm-up warm-up will take around uh, two minutes so bear with me and uh, once this is done you should be able to you should be very good to access the labs
So this lab will be available for two hours initially. But uh, once you need for more, you can uh, come here and trigger it again. But uh, uh, I would suggest to practice uh, two hours every day or maybe uh, use different IDs. The best way is to study two hours each day and uh, while you are working. So that will be nice. OK, so just click on the T. The user ID will be copied. Oh, sorry, it got the subscription wrong. My bad. Just uh, get rid of this and then type the user ID. Go click next. And uh, then there will be an password. No need to memorize this. No need to copy it uh, somewhere because it not be it, it cannot be used outside this uh, VM. OK, now it is asking me to turn off. Yes, uh, I need to turn on the user ID and the password and then say save it, save the user ID and the password and the prompt should say no. It is showing, showing me that it is not authorized. Um, I think we have to run the uh, uh, administrator tool and say yes. And then I should use this user ID. And submit. Uh, so this is basically the admin provisioning tool. What it does in the backend is it, it sets up the AAD to this user ID and uh, also the Active Directory to be uh, governed by the uh, this domain. And then uh, in the backend, it will start the services, uh, the batch services, the uh, DMFF services, the management reporter, as well as the IIS. So it will try to reset everything once it is done we should see a success message. This may take time, probably two to three minutes. And once done, then you should be able to access the uh, Dynamics 365 Finance and Operation without any hurdle. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it is successful. Go back here and try to log in again. Username, password is already saved, so it is taking in. And now the error should not come that you are not a recognized user. So first step is to uh, log launch the VM. Once it is launched, try to uh, click on the administrative uh, user provisioning that is called admin user provisioning and then when, once this is done you will be able to access it so now you get a lot of modules you can then based on your uh, based on your lab you can practice it or based on the instructions you will be able to do the labs okay again this is very uh, bigger screen or smaller again you can use this to bigger and shorter the screens even you can use the biggest screen as well so by this, uh, you, we are successful in demonstrating that you can get a free um, hands-on lab for two hours every day uh, to practice your uh, scenarios in finance and operation. Thank you very much and you have a good day.